Welcome back, everybody. A lot of blue sky to finish Thursday across Upper Michigan. Got some clouds there, but thinning out and giving way to sunshine like over Marquette from our TV6 weather cam. Over in Landmark Inn, we want to take a dip into the water. No, it's still above 30 degrees or so. Uh, it is quite chilly outside. You'll feel that soothing sunshine, but temperatures are in the low 20s. Over in Marquette, light northeast winds. We're under high pressure across the UP. Almanac data from National Weather Service Marquette, a high of 27 degrees. The highest of the highs today over in Stevenson at 37 degrees. That is the average high for this time of year, 37. A low temperature of 7 degrees at the weather forecast office. Our lowest low reported, minus 3 in Wakefield. Sunset tonight at 8.05 p.m. Eastern time, so less than a couple hours to enjoy the sun before the clouds start to increase overnight in a system racing across the northern plains north of Rapid City. We've got some winter weather advisories if you're traveling south to Wisconsin tomorrow and also towards the weekend over to lower Michigan. There's a potential for six inches of snowfall for some areas like around Sheboygan and down to Detroit. For us in upper Michigan, light to occasional moderate snow. Still make things slippery for your commute tomorrow. Future radar and wind gusts increasing clouds across the western half of the region by the midnight hour. Light snow over the west end, but then moving eastward at a quick pace into the early morning hours of Friday. So slippery start to Friday across the UP, especially towards Menominee by the morning. And then for afternoon hours, it'll start to dry up for some areas like the west end of the UP still impacting. I think this precipitation line is pretty much outlining the frontal system crossing the central counties during the afternoon. There'll be occasional moderate snow for the central and eastern counties through Friday night. We'll get a break in the action from the snow over the west Friday night, but once the system exits towards early Saturday, here comes lake effect snow from Lake Superior to start Saturday. Snowfall forecast, a few inches to start your day Friday, and then by the end of it, it could be three inches for some areas or more for the east and southern UP. For the northern half of the region, we could get three inches or more snowfall totaled when lake effect comes into play. Tonight's lows ranging from the teens to the lower 20s south. A few inland areas across upper Michigan we could sneak down to the single digits for the highs tomorrow, the upper 20s north, mid 30s towards the south. Extended forecast, TV6 extended forecast. We're looking at a sunny beginning to the weekend Saturday after that lake effect tapers off. But into Sunday, here comes a system from the central plains. It looks to be a juicy system. Could bring some heavy snow to the western UP by Monday. And then as we get a little bit warmer, you got some rain in the mix. So some slush, some ice to watch out for Monday and Tuesday. That's why I've got that warning light in there. We'll keep an eye on that. Yellow caution for early next week. Got it. Thank you, Noelle. We'll be sure to watch the roads, too. It sounds like those could be an issue. Yeah, good. Yep. Thank you, Noelle. TV6 is Kevin.